Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I have a little presentation for you. So in The Sims 4, building, I love building, but I feel like there could be a better organization for this because sometimes I just scroll and scroll and scroll and I can't find the things that I want and it stresses me out. For example, as you can see, this is what styled rooms look like. They have this subcategory and I think we could do something like this for other categories. For example, imagine plant categories. So like table plants, floor plants, wall plants, hanging plants. Now I will say we don't have a lot of hanging plants at the moment, but maybe this could be their sign to add a lot more because you know, it would just be nice. And then we have our clutter category, which I feel like is a must. So we have kitchen clutter, kid clutter, bedroom clutter, office clutter, entrance clutter, living room clutter, and etc. whatever you can think of because it's just like moments where I'm like scrolling scrolling and can't find anything so like there's plates from snowy escape horse ranch home shelf hustle that could be in the kitchen clutter section and in the kid clutter section there's things from like parenthood growing together and then we have painting categories so we have our grunge decals so we have grunge decals with the for rent pack from werewolves I think maybe vampires and uh, the basement treasures kit if they could just you know put those together in a subcategory it would save us a lot of time because there's a lot of grunge decals and then there's a lot of just decals especially from cats and dogs I think and then we have our posters I would love for the posters to also be grouped together and then we have like framed slash canvas also a category is the windows so I was thinking like round windows and what I mean by that is basically we have the circle windows from cats and dogs from base game from Rome of magic from my wedding stories and we also have this half circle window from cats and dogs and I don't know I think it'll be easier for us to find if they were just you know categorized better same with like the clutter and paintings also if this helps you you could just put the round windows with the small windows if you want to but you know and then we have like the couch categories this is pretty small but again it would just be useful for the couch categories I think we could have sofa and love seats and that's pretty much it there are some benches that show up in this category which I don't think they should. They should show up in the outdoor furniture but if you build by object by function you would know that there is a sofa in love seat option or category but I feel like most people don't build that way. I just find it easier to build by the room so I still think it would just be very efficient if they added subcategories the way it looks like for the styled rooms and it's the same with the lamps. They have the object by function but again it would just be efficient if there were subcategories by the room because I just feel like most people probably built that way and I don't think it's gonna like be a problem or take up any space it's just easier so for the lights we have table lamps floor lamps wall lamps ceiling lamps candles and outdoor lights and there's just more possibilities so for example mirrors you have the wall mirror we have the floor mirror, we have the vanity, and the leaning mirror. So we only have two leaning mirrors at the moment, but if they want to make more, please go ahead. And then I also have dressers. So for example, there are these hanging clothes from high school years horse ranch and dream home decorator and they also like obviously come with like the shelf and the wardrobe so this is what I'm talking about basically so you can just like hang clothes on here but the thing is these shelves these wardrobes they don't come in the dresser section you have to go to object by function you have to go to surfaces and then you can go to displays, which is just kind of annoying. I feel like they should be in the dresser section. Imagine if we had like subcategories over here and then like you can click on hanging clothes and then they show you all the hanging clothes, but also with the shelves that go with them. So now we're gonna talk about the curtain. So I think there should be subcategories by wall height. So, you know, short wall height, medium wall height and then tall wall height it would just make it easier instead of like accidentally keep clicking on the wrong one not to mention that some of them are not with their pack they're just kind of in there and also with the rugs because sometimes you just want to look for a small rug a medium rug a big rug or a runner and then for the hobbies i said to just put them together for example all of the easels and etc in the same place so currently 
the easels are just anywhere so we have one easel right here but if you want a better easel you just have to keep scrolling keep scrolling like I just wish they were at the same place as I showed here just put them together okay it makes sense if they were put together instead of like spread across the whole place you know what I mean so like for the guitars for the treadmills for the punching bags you know whatever you can think of just put them together please it would just be very useful but you know if you guys have any other suggestions for this please let me know in the comments there is a chance that i possibly forgot to mention something and honestly like the sculptures are also a mess like for one why is this in here you can put this in kitchen clutter you can put this in kid clutter and also like the miscellaneous decorations bread box kitchen clutter napkins kitchen clutter dish rack kitchen clutter this can also be kid clutter and then you have like these little hutches like kitchen clutter having a subcategory like this would be so useful think about it i mean even the wall decorations are kind of like everywhere but like what are you gonna do about that i feel like this should just be in the painting category look at all these decals and posters oh my gosh why is this in here no offense it's not a painting it's not a poster this is also not a painting or a poster like i can deal with this like this can go under framed pictures or paintings this is not a painting why is that in there it's just it's very questionable but anyways if you do have anything else please let me know in the comments and i'm just gonna end this video off here before i keep thinking of other stuff but if you like this video please like comment and subscribe i love you you are important and i will see you guys soon bye